interestingly, the type one pick one for this can't be as your third pick. We have to pretend there's no battlefield under card there. Or we can assume that I drafted those two with my rare, with my first picks in the set. No. no. That's not an accurate thing. I mean, no, because I would totally jump if I. What? So this is pack one pick one for triple battle. For triple battle? Okay. Alright. <coughs> we have Seek the Wild. One in a green. Look at the top four cards of your library. You may reveal a creature or land card from among them. Put them into your hand. Put the rest on the bottom of your library in any order. Oracle of Dust. Four in a blue. Devoid. Two. Put a card an opponent owns from exile into that player's graveyard to draw a card and then discard a card. So, two end process to um, loot. Oh, it was rummage other er earlier. Okay. Alter's Reap. One in a black. As an additional cost to cast Alter's Reap, sacrifice a creature. Draw two cards. Plummet. Destroy target creature with flying. Volcanic Upheaval. Upheaval. Three in a red to destroy target land. Stonehaven Medic. One in a white. White and tap. You gain one life. It's a 1-3. This reminds me of when we started playing in M15. Soulminder. It was Soulbender. Yeah, Soulminder. I think that's what it's called. Which was a 1-1 one, one for 1, and then you could tap it to gain a life. Yeah. But it didn't cost you mana, so it's, you know, this one's worse. McKinney Slide Runner. One in a red to trample, landfall. Whenever a land enters the battlefield in your control, it gets plus one, plus one until end of turn. Gideon's Reproach. One in a white, instant. It deals four damage to a target attacking or blocking creature. That's really good. That's good removal. Life Spring Druid. Tap to add mana, or for two in a green, it's a two-one. Tap to add one mana of any color to your mana pool. Valakut Predator. Two in a red landfall. Whenever a land enters the battlefield under your control, Valakut Predator deals, gets plus two plus two until end of turn. Retreat to Kazandu. We have another one. I can put it in my thingamajig because I've been wanting to test it. Awesome. All right, so Retreat to Kazandu. Two in a green enchantment. And then landfall, you can pick either put a 1-1 one, one counter on target creature or you gain two life. It's an uncommon. And I'm doing a hardened scales, like cheap hardened scales brew. So that'll go in there. And I'm going to try that out. Slab hammer for two colorless. It's an equipment. Whenever an equipped creature attacks, you may return a land you control to its owner's hand. If you do, the creature gets plus two, plus two till end of turn. Equip for two. It's terrible. It's actually better than you think. It's okay. But you have to bounce your land every time. So I guess landfall. Exactly. Okay. Uh, Royal spout. One white, blue, put target creature on top of its owner's library with Awaken for four white, blue. Here comes the rare. Noyantar, we got a fish! <laughs> <laughs> we got the rare folk! Four, four for three white, blue. When you three, you cast an instant or sorcery spell. You may put three one, one counters on target land you control. If you do, that land becomes a zero, zero elemental creature with haste, still a land. Sorry about that. Ooh, you got a foil one. Hi there, Rob. <coughs> no and And then a mountain and a core ally token. Alrighty, so. <coughs> limited. Pack one. Pick one. I have decided. Are we ready? What? Oh, show her on the pack again. Oh, I have to put it back in. All right. Seek the Wilds. Oracle of Dust. Alter's Reap. Plummet. Volcanic Upheaval. Stonehaven Medic. McKinney Slide Runner. Gideon's Reproach. Life Spring Druid. Valakut Predator. Retreat to Kazandu. Slap Hammer. Royal Spout, Noyan Dar, Royal Shaper, Mountain, Core Ally Token.
All right, we're done. Ooh, I did not agree with our chat, with chat. All right, so Noyandar won. So for everybody, that is Noyandar, our merfolk. But I would pick Royal Spout. Really? I want the removal. It's a good set of colors. I can go into blue-white flyers, blue-white lands, awaken, those sorts of things. It's it's just really good removal. It, it removes a, a creature, and it takes them back a turn. They don't get their draw step. But it's in two colors. Like, aren't you safer going with a... a Everyone else is voting for Noyandar. Yeah, but that's so powerful. Like, that is great removal if you're already in blue-white. I would pick, I would pick Gideon's Reproach first, because you're likely to wheel the multicolor. That's removal. true. I guess I might wheel Royal Spout. I don't know. <laughs> okay, if I was playing to win and not playing for money, probably. That's a little bit different. <coughs> yeah. Um, that's what Carrick also said. Two colors on first pick is a little bit dangerous. <laughs>